Enderman. <laughs> How high up do you want the house? Um, we should start with, like, a platform. Should yeah. I do, like, a spruce floor, you think? I have a lot of that. Yeah. Okay, I'm okay. gonna get some tools. I'm gonna cut some trees down. Okay, here. Um, so you want it, you want the house, like, high up, right? Yeah. Okay, so I'll... I want people to fear me. Yeah, so I'll pile up. And then I'll build, like, the floor. Do you want the house to be, like, multiple levels? Like, two, like, two levels. Okay. I think maybe a like little... a dungeon inside the yeah. Um, I think maybe a little bit lower than this. Yeah. Be good. Also, if you she if you see sheep, kill them so we can have somewhere to sleep. I made crafting table. Cool. So that can be useful. Do you think this is high enough up? Because um, I was thinking like the top of it, if it's gonna be two stories. Wait, let me see. Picture it as two stories. With, like, a roof. Yeah, that's yeah. pretty tall. So we gotta get up there somehow. Yeah. Do you want to do, like, a cool staircase or a ladder to get up? Um, sure. Like, a, no, like, we a could staircase. Do a, yeah, okay. That'd be pretty, you know? Do you want to do a spiral staircase or, like, a normal staircase? A spiral. Are you okay? <laughs> oh, it's nighttime? Yeah. Mm, but we don't have a bed. We should have got a bed. We should have gone around. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because we don't have spawn points. We should have took the bed from the villagers. I am pretty sure that we're just on the other side of the mountain behind the community center, though, so if we do end up dying and we respawn there, we should be able to get back. Yeah. I can make a chest right now. Maybe if you want to put the chests up here on the platform, yeah. we could just keep everything up here. So, like... In case we do die, we can just put our stuff in there. Because yeah. we know we're going to die at some point. So I'm also going to make um, uh, torches. Cause torches? Oh my god, there's a... Help, torches. help. Let me up, let me up, let me up. <laughs> Here, I'll make you, like, I'll try to make you a staircase. I'm a parkour god. I did it. I put torches up here so that things don't spawn up here. So we should be pretty safe. You know what really makes me mad? What? I can't. This. Oh yeah. Okay. Um. You know those things that fly? The phantoms. Yeah, those make me so mad. Yeah. Like. I think everyone collectively hates them. Cause why did you add that to here? Like. Whatever. Why would you do that? And it's so <laughs> creepy. Cause like, you don't know when they're coming. They just swoop down and peck you. Yeah. <laughs> peck oh, oh my God! This Enderman. <laughs> Did I tell you I'm scared of Enderman? You did. They remind me of my sleep paralysis demons. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. No. That's not a... I don't know what that is. That's a spider. I'm on a heart and a half, but I don't have any food, so... Here, I have, I have bread. I have a lot of bread. Oh. Thank you. Why isn't they giving it? I don't know. Oh wait, I can find a chest and I'll give you half. There you go. Thank you. I'm gonna make that and please. So the house might look kind of out of place for a little bit, but what I'm gonna do is that I'll make smooth stone and I'll put it around so it looks more natural. But is are you okay with this being the general size of the house? Like this would be the size of the room. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, cool. And then do you want to do? I'm thinking for multiple levels instead of just doing like normal stairs and another floor. I'm thinking like like a loft almost. So like the front of it goes all the way up, and then there's like a ledge. You know what would be cool? What? If, like, you don't play Genshin, right? No. Okay, so basically, 
There's like one floor, and then here. Okay, this is the floor, right? Uh huh. And then it goes like that. Not like that. Okay, hold on. There's a spider. Like that. And it goes to another room, but it'd be stairs. You know? Kind of. Okay, so like this is the stairs, and this is the room. You know? This is the stairs, and this is the room? No, no, see, this. You know this? Stairs, right? Stairs. stairs. Yeah. And then it goes up to the side, and there's like a room. Another room. It's really cool, isn't it? In my head, it's cool. Maybe. Here, if you want to build, like, let's start with just the floors. Yeah. So just do the platform for the floors of all the rooms, and then we'll connect them with stairs. Just so we can see what the general design is. How tall do you want the ceiling to be? I want it tall, you know? Okay. Like a bat? No. Maybe, like, four tall? Yeah. Okay. Four tall, then the floor of the second floor. Yeah. And then four tall again. I'm just gonna be like bouncing between projects all the time on this because I have lots and lots and lots of ideas. Yeah, lots of ideas too. So say like this stone where it is, that's where the floor of the next room is gonna be, like the ceiling. Yeah. So here, um, I'll give you some spruce planks. Build the platform wherever you want it to be. Also, don't mind the spiders dropping down on us from above. <laughs> Where are they coming from? Up there. Rude. Invasive. <laughs> Not cool. Wait, look, wait. Okay, wait. Wait! What? I have to in my mind. Whatever you end up doing for the platform, could I replace the stairs with stone bricks? Yeah. I think it'll just look a little bit nicer. I think I know what you're trying to do. You see? I mean, a brick ton of stairs. Yeah. This side? That's what I think is cool. I bet we could do both ideas, because we could have yours going off to the side, and then I can do the loft thing. Yeah. Up here. Yeah. I used to believe in Hero Brian, so I thought, like, if you venture out far enough, you could find him. <laughs> they used to do that a lot. There was a series on YouTube called the Hero Brian Documentaries, and I was always convinced that it was real. It was a very, very well made series. I'm gonna watch that. I don't know. I think some of them have been taken down. What? Maybe all of it. But it's been re-uploaded. Oh, okay. I just, it's kind of difficult to find. Like, I try to find it every once in a while. Because nostalgia. Yeah. But I can't. Or the SCP thing. Yeah. That was my shit, bro. I love that so much. Oh, yeah, that's a creeper. Oh, man. So way back in. That's copyright shit, isn't it? Yeah. Why can't we, whatever. <laughs> Royalty free music. Bear with me here. I just haven't dug out the top yet. This is going decently quickly. See, the last thing took a while because we didn't gather materials before starting. We just started. Yeah. Which is how I like to build. I kind of just like to go for it. No, we just make human farm. You got it, bro. We were having lots of fun, but Raven had to go, so I was left all alone. I need one dark oak sapling. I have three, but I don't know where the forest is. Oh, is Kelly online? Yeah. The traitor, Hades Kingdom, even though we're not technically in a kingdom anymore, because <laughs> it's just going to be a resort now. Yes. Is that, is that what we decided? Uh, I don't know. If that's what you decided, I'm fine with it. I think, I think it's going to be like a, a house for everyone, or like different houses for everyone. Alright. I think that's what Lily wanted. It's whatever. I didn't really want to live in a cave. I just wanted to have a house in a cave, and that accomplishes my means. Remember when I found a block of raw iron ore, like a whole chunk? No. And it was worth like nine iron ore ingots, and I was like, what's this doing here? I don't remember that. Oh, well it turns out, that's part that's part of one of those really rare iron ore veins I was talking about earlier. Oh. And we could have had thousands of iron ore, and I no longer remember where it was. So Dang. that's fun. What the heck, Ty? I'm sorry, I didn't know... I'm working on, so I was with Raven earlier, and we were, basically we started building a house that I think is going to end up being their house, but we were talking about, like, temporarily sharing a house. I'm still building in that flower forest. I found it, by the way, and it's very pretty, so I'm building over there. Nice. But I'm kind of just working on this because we started working on it, and I like the idea that we had, so I'm just going to finish it. What are you working on right now? Um, a house, like, up in a cliff. Well, that's cool. Where are you going? Ah! That didn't happen. 
heard nothing. All right. If you want to come check it out, I think I'm behind the um the hill. Like you know where the community center is. I'm like behind that hill behind that. You know. Mm. Yeah, I'll come take a look soon. I just have to wrap up some uh, some stuff here. Yeah. Okay. At the cave place, Lily has been working on it. She's already constructed two houses, and they're really cool. Yes, yeah, so I found out you can take damage on scaffolding. <laughs> okay, never mind. I, for the longest time, I was like, oh my gosh, you can't take damage on scaffolding. And I was like, oh yeah, so I found out you can't as I was jumping onto it, because that reminded me, and then I died immediately. <laughs> so you can now take damage on scaffolding. What a way to go. Taking damage on scaffolding? Yeah. Right. Okay, see, this time I fell and I didn't take any damage. Oh my gosh, my stuff is up to Maybe it's just random. Yeah, honestly, it feels that way. Sometime soon, I want to begin my work on Fred's kingdom. I think while I work on other things, I'll just be working on that in the background, since it's going to take me the longest. I'm in, I'm in no condition to sleep right now. Sorry. It's okay. I can't sleep either. Okay, too many creepers. Creeper. Oh, man. It's like the sword of my life. Okay, that's pretty much everything I remember being in my inventory. I don't know if it is everything. I'm, I'm, I don't care anymore about losing things because I just want to live my life and oh. not have to worry about the little things, yeah. the material wealth and such. Yes. And like I might have said before, the more stuff you lose, the more likely you are to keep being interested for a yeah, long time. Yeah, I'm going to be like Minecraft, what is it, a hippie, a Minecraft hippie. Yeah. Just go with the flow and the thousands of creepers that continue to follow me. If you ever get deep slate you don't want, I'll take it, because I, I think I'm going to use that for Fred's kingdom. It's going to be mostly deep slate. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, because our, our thing is in a deep slate area, so we'll have a lot. And you can almost come here to mine as well. Yeah. Deep slate's really annoying to break, though, because it takes two times as long. Yeah. Everything in deep slate takes two times as long to break. I'm still upset about the, this coal shortage. It's really been affecting my day-to-day -day life. Yeah. Um, I plan on, probably when I'm done working on this thing with Raven, I'm gonna make a giant tree grove with all the different trees in it, and just make a rule that you have to replant after you cut a tree down, and then I'm, next to it, I'm gonna put just a little place where I can make a ton of charcoal for everyone. Yeah. And I'll just deliver it to people every once in a while, I'm not gonna, like, sell it or anything. Yeah, that'd be cool. By the way, I, we also, every single cave I go in, I find 30 million slime, so if you ever need slime, just hit me up. Alright. I'll, I'll trade you for some coal. The new the new currency of every world is now going to be coal. I need dark oak saplings. Alright, there's a dark oak forest over yonder. Do you remember, if you head, if you start heading over to our place, it passes the dark oak forest. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll go that way. I it spruces all over the place, but I can't remember the location of it. Yeah. But otherwise, I know where pretty much everything else is. I found a mason, too. I wonder where that is. Oh, copper is too annoying now. I don't like it. It's the new coal. Yeah, it's everywhere. Oh, look, diamonds. That's See, up. I haven't found any diamonds yet, probably because I've barely been mining at all. I found way too many. I'm just going to be philanthropist. Like, like, like when I gave Lily 60 diamonds, the next time I get enough, I'm just going to give random people that. I'll be like Mr. Beast, but Mr. Backers. <laughs> Alright. Well, that would imply that Mr. Beast gives away beasts. <laughs> Maybe he does give away beasts. Maybe that's it. That's the secret. I was climbing a thing and a skeleton shot me off of the thing. I made a shield now to try and avoid mobs and I keep forgetting to use it. I'm trying to remember what direction to go in because I don't want to lose all my stuff. No, you know what? I'm stealing a villager's bed. Because I need to be able to sleep at that place that I'm working at. I love how sometimes when you fall, you just don't take damage. I stole a bed from a child. You <laughs> stole a bed from a child. Yeah. Because if you take it from the children, then they don't get mad at you because you don't have to punch them to get the bed. True. You know, in, in the new update, one of the changes they added is pillagers no longer kill baby villagers. That's good. Yeah. 
But it's, I, I just imagine a bunch of twins just flip over a villain and leave the babies. And then as soon as the baby grows, they murder all of them. Yeah. You're no longer so a child. We no longer want you. It's so annoying. I have no food and all these zombies are going to kill me. Because I don't know where I am. More diamonds. Huzzah. I think it's over there. I think I see it. I'll just hide in the water so this spider doesn't go after me. You know what's kind of sad is I have more diamonds than I have coal. Yeah. <laughs> that is sad. I, that's an issue. Quite a problem. You know, as much as I hate, like, all the new changes in the update, the cha at the very least, it is change, and that adds a ton of... It, the game is totally new now. Yeah. It just, it's just so different than before. Now, I don't all like all the differences, but it, I have to adapt to certain challenges now. Like, the severe lack of coal. So, it's, it's fun, I guess. Yeah. I tend to find it a lot more, like, while I'm working on this project, because I'm digging into the side of a mountain. Yeah, because it's... Well, the thing is, this coal is, like, above y equals zero, but every cave just goes straight to below that. So yeah. you always end up below it. Yeah. Wow, um, zombies, let me be. They need to tone down the mob spawning. Oh my gosh. Yeah. It's a real problem. It is an issue. Like, if it's even a little bit dark, there's just a million. Yeah, it's like I killed them all, and immediately, like, there's more than that many spawning. Okay, I'm gonna attempt to move this bed real quick up onto the thing. If I die on the way, I'll cry. It's like... 20 blocks that I need to move this bed or I'll lose my spawn point. I did that once. Okay. I, I broke my bed and tried to move it and on my way in moving it I died and then I lost my spawn point. Yeah. I found I, diamonds. I'm just gonna embrace it now. I've got 36 coal. That's... I want it. <laughs> Rolling in coal right now. I'm, I want your coal. I want your coal so bad. Well, you can have some. I'll give you diamonds for it. Alright. In my little excavation I had, since I logged on, I've gained 13 diamonds. Just mm. from exploring. Nice. Okay, and now I've cornered. I'm so far down, I don't want to bother digging up. That's one thing. It's like, when you used to be like, oh, you're cornered in a cave, you don't need to retrace your steps, you can just dig up. But now it's like, your pickaxe will probably break before you break surface level. Yeah. I want to start a strip mine, but I'm also worried that I'm going to keep running into caves and have to create new strip mines, because I'll keep running into caves. If you want diamonds, the lower, apparently, the higher the spawn rate. Huh. I'm, I'm waiting to find an iron ore so we can be set with iron for life. That would be nice. Are they rare? Um, extremely. I mean, I already found one, but I didn't know what it was at the time. Good job, Ty. What? Good job, Ty. Yeah, I found a giant, I found a uh, raw iron ore block, and I was like, what's this doing here? And I broke it, and then moved on with my life, like, the first time I spawned into the game. And now I googled how to find them, and it turns out they spawn in those, and they're extremely rare. And I was like, oh my gosh. Huh. Because when I was telling people about it, they were like, oh, it's probably just a glitch. And I was like, that's not how glitches work. It's not like when Minecraft is spawning in Cobblestone, oh, it accidentally spawned in an Ender Dragon. I mean, that's not how it works. I was getting fuzzled, but I didn't think of it right at the time. And that was my fatal flaw. I guess I'm going to finish placing all the spruce for this, and then I can't really work on it anymore until I get dark oak. That's a giant crevasse. This is an even bigger crevasse. I really like saying crevasse. Honestly, this is more like a crevice, because it's larger, so I can't really say crevasse in an accurate sense here. But I don't care, it's a crevasse. I thought crevasse was just a funny way to say crevice. Crevasse is like a smaller crevice. Oh. I googled it because they said it in a show and I, I thought it sounded so sneaky. I must learn it. Because one, one day I plan on looting enough sneaky words to infiltrate my arch enemies the French. <laughs> you know, I feel like this update like, wouldn't be the same if they hadn't changed the world type. Because like, I'm at Y20 and I'm just in like this tiny dip in the ground. And it goes down, like, 80 more blocks, but it would have only gone down, like, 20 more blocks, and that would have been sad. Yeah. So, I'm honestly glad they did it. It's a much better change. Yeah. 
Uh, I think I'm probably gonna log off. Apparently, people have been having performance issues because of it, though. I'm gonna I'm gonna log off. So good, goodbye.